So just bear in mind that one Okay yeah. tutup Sebab aku nak ada lasi <laughs> Tutup Kita move on Hakim Ziyech We were talking about this Dixon just now uh, Six chances created Wow In one game Two assists Maybe I'll start with you Kish um, This is Some people say Some players don't even achieve this In a whole season Some mm. some maybe average uh, Midfielders uh, Left footer mm. Pinpoint accuracy Dengan passes Dia tengok je macam mana Cross dia untuk Chilwell lah itu Wih, adakah ini permulaan untuk Hakim Ziyech? I, bila Hakim Ziyech diumumkan sebagai pemain Chelsea, kemudian ni ada Timo Werner, Kai Havertz. Sebagai hmm. aku banding dengan semua transfer, yang aku paling excited sebenarnya memang jelas Ziyech. Daripada awal. Serious, Kerana eh? dekat Ajax juga, okay. ada satu statistik lah yang Skoka ada publish, yes. yang memang blew my mind away. Between 2017 until March 2020, Hakim Ziyech had the most shots most assists most uh, shots on target ada so many different criteria and he was the highest in 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 a uh, area division in terms mm. of his chances creation so he's clearly one of the most creative players bukan mm. saja dekat pastu ramai yang kata oh itu liga belanda liga belanda ni mudahlah Suka tak lehlah kita nak bandingkan dengan premier league mm. tapi zh bila ajax masuk champions league semi final 2018 2019 that season no one attempted more shots mm. than Hakim Ziyech except mm. Lionel Messi. Ah. Messi had more shots in the in the whole yes. tournament. Second place was Ziyech. He had more shots than Son Heung-min. Lagi banyak shots daripada Neymar. Lagi banyak shots daripada Lewandowski even. Mm. Shot, so Ziyech is a player that will create chances but he's also you give him the tiniest bit of space <laughs> ada ruang sikit pun that's it lah. Boom. Mm. Dia wow. akan attempt a shot. And Chelsea tak ada pemain macam tu. Itu yang menjadikan Ziyech a very very exciting player to watch. Nah itu yang mungkin um, ramai tak nampak eh daripada Hakim Ziyech. Okey. Um, menyentuh tentang Hakim Ziyech ni, when we talk about Hakim Ziyech um Dixon, when you see him as a player and and the kind of passes that he can do, whether it's a long ball yeah. pass or whether it's a short pass or whether it's a visionary pass oh. as a player, as a striker mm. Is that the kind of midfielder that you want to work with? Because sometimes, um, you know, you may not get what you want, but yeah. you know, he may drift in and out of yeah. games. But as as a striker, would you rather play with a midfielder like this or someone more direct? Oh, everybody play for players. Strikers play for players like Ziyech. It makes your job easy. <laughs> sometimes they see you beat one, two, three players. Strikers don't really like that. Strikers just want to score. You save your energy. So when you get player like Ziyech, you can score one, two, three goals mm. in one game. When Chelsea signed him, I was so angry because I'm Arsenal <laughs> fan. And, <laughs> they, <laughs> and they got him very cheap. cheap. I don't know. Yeah. This guy should what, be one fifty six million pounds. Yeah, he should yeah. be one fifty million pounds. Easily, eh? I, yeah. When they got him, my heart. <laughs> like, I, 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 why, Michael Arteta? Why? Yeah, I why? Panic, why? Dollar yeah. Saleh never buy him a show. <laughs> Dola no. Saleh beli Hakim Ziyech. <laughs> This guy is amazing. He's, okay. he's so talented, super talented. All right. Let's like, pick up a call and see what they have to say as well. Mm. Hello, siapa di sana? Hello? Hello? Takut dah tu. <laughs> Hello? Hello. Ah, namanya? Najib. Najib? Ya. Yeah. Dari mana Najib? Dari Melaka. Tim mana? EPL? EPL? Chelsea. 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 Oh, kena lah kita sembang pasal Hakim Ziyech Ok, kau fan Chelsea So kau mesti tahu satu fakta ni Yang aku nampak um, uh, Ada dua player selain daripada Ziyech Yang dapat buat six chances created ni Rhys James uh, Dan juga Kevin De Bruyne uh, Dalam game lawan Wolves ketika City menang 3-1 Rhys James uh, Sorry um, Yelah uh, Kevin, Kevin De Bruyne Masa lawan Wolves Rhys James masa lawan West Brom Dan Bruno Fernandes masa lawan Newcastle Oh sedih nak sebut tu Six chances Bruno created okay? So bila cerita pasal Rhys James dengan Ziyech Di belah kanan itu uh, Ramai yang nampak itu adalah satu um, uh, Taktikal ataupun dua pemain ini Sukar diganti pada ketika ini Lampard harus kekalkan Komen kau? Rasanya kena guna line up hmm. lah. Sekarang lah hmm. Yang hari tu masa menang lawan Di Ayo ah, baru ni lah Okay Maknanya Harvard ah. tak ada tempat dalam tim kau? Harvard dia kena Bagi ah, Tengok dulu Sebab hari tu masa start Bagi dia main pun Dia pun macam struggle lagi 
So bagi dia tengok lah Macam mana Fan rapat punya Taktik semua uh, Baru dia Boleh masuk Boleh fit dengan Fan rapat punya taktik hmm. So kau rasa apa yang berlaku hari tu Yang menampak satu dengan Sheffield United Itulah team kau sekarang Maknanya Tak payah chop and change yeah. Tak payah squad rotation Itulah first team kau yang terbaik Boleh nak rotation Tapi ikut pada uh, Pertandingan lah Alright. Oh maknanya ha. kalau main uh, UCL boleh rotate lah. Ha boleh rotate lah. Okey. Ha. Ataupun Karabau ke ataupun uh, FA ha. Cup ke. Okey faham faham. Terima kasih bro. Ya, ada soalan. Aku nak kau nak aku tanya so, kau nak tanya Dickson ke? Kau nak tanya Mat Stat ke? Ah ha, Dickson, Dickson. Ha, silakan. Ah ha, Dickson. Ha Bosco. Hai. <laughs> Hai Bosco. <laughs> ya ya. <laughs> Uh. Uh, I want to ask you uh. After this mm. After you retire the Pahang team yeah. Where you where you want to go And what you want to do uh, I think I still want to play In Malaysia Not outside Malaysia If not If I cannot get what I'm looking for I will retire I have academy in Nigeria I will take care of this academy Wow. Oh, okay. Ada satu lagi. lagi satu lagi. Ada satu lagi. Wei cepat dekat masa Mastat. ni. Ha. <laughs> oh, dekat Mastat okay, lah. Okay. MU, eh. Ha, pasal MU. Okay, silakan. Okay, kalau abang sebagai seorang coach. Okay. Kira abang duduk dekat tempat oleh lah. Okay. Uh, suka soalan macam ni. Ha, betul. Apa line up yang abang nak pakai ataupun... Informasi apa yang abang nak pakai. Okay. Bro, biar Kish jawab. Kucak terima kasih kerana okay. kesetiaan anda. Okay? Terima kasih. Happy terima kasih, bro. bro. Terbaik, bro. Okay. Kalau kau boleh. <laughs> kau kan mat stat. Kau kena lah, Kish. Beranikan kena. diri kau. Lambat ada soalan macam ni kat aku kan. <laughs> okay. Tak ada-tada. Okay. I mean, aku tak rasa dunia bola sepak moden ni ada satu formasi saja yang perlu diguna pakai. Mungkin perlu ada identiti, falsafah untuk sesebuah pasukan. Tetapi formasi seringkali bertukar. Hmm. Itu yang aku bila berbincang dengan rakan-rakan kan. Sekarang ni aku dah tak cakap, oh Chelsea guna 4-2-3-1 sahaja. Tak, hmm. tak. Sebab dalam satu game tu, kadang-kadang jurulatih akan mengubah corak taktikal 2-3 kali. Yep. Contoh terbaik, United pun dalam kemenangan ke atas PSG. Hmm. Dalam game tu saja ada ubah sistem lebih kurang 3 kali. Dari diamond kepada 3 at the back kepada... Uh, 4-4-2 at some points Jadi pertukaran Tactical flexibility Atas padang tu okay. Cukup penting Dalam modern football Apa yang aku akan Kata buat masa sekarang is Oleh perlu mencari Identiti untuk pasukan ini hmm. Ada sedikit Gambaran identiti tersebut Is penggunaan pemain-pemain yang begitu laju di bahagian hadapan hmm. Seperti Rashford, Martial, Greenwood Benda tu aku rasa dah obvious hmm. Oleh suka striker Yang laju, laju. Pantas Betul. Tapi Selepas itu Apa Bagaimana nak gunakan identiti itu untuk membina identiti hmm. pasukan secara keseluruhan. Aku rasa itu yang kurang sikit daripada oleh berbanding dengan jurulatih seperti Klopp. Yang ada identiti yang begitu tepat. Formasi Klopp pun selalu berubah Betul, ber- ikut hmm. perlawanan. Hmm. Tapi identiti itu ada. Falsafah itu ada. Okay. So benda tu yang aku rasa paling penting untuk oleh okay. sekarang. Pendek cerita, bro dia tak jawablah soalan kau. <laughs> Aku tak nak lah bagi satu formasi je. Sebab memang tak logik Nixon, kalau bagi satu formasi je. Nixon went all over but he didn't answer the guy's question, Nixon. But never mind, Kish. I know you.